Um, I'm live. <laughs> we are experiencing difficulties. What happens if you go over there, right, is if you click on that link? Tell me what you should be able to watch me here. And actually, you should go and hear if you can hear me okay. Actually, could you give me that water, please? So, you should just accept or whatever. Mm -hmm. Could you give me that water, there, please? Thanks. Okay, so yeah, you want to go here to see if you hear me okay? Because I don't even hear me coming through that computer. Some people are coming in, so I know that, I know that they're getting the message. Great, can you? Okay, I'm getting you. Okay, so you can hear me, right? Yep. Okay. So, right, is I think you want to mute the sound and come back. Okay. Hey everybody, so sorry, thank you so much. We are doing this for the first time and I knew there were gonna be some difficulties and it's the way to learn these things because it's kind of complicated figuring out the Google Hangout. So I wanna confirm that everybody is okay but most everybody's in a screenshot there. Is there a way for someone to chat to me? Because you'll be able to see the chats that come in. Is there a, is there a way for us, maybe people can Below, because you can drive right if you see the actual event page. Good, okay, so fantastic. People are saying that. Okay, good, okay. Now, whoever's not muted, you're going to want to mute yourself just so we don't hear you. Um, but yeah, we're going to give this a couple minutes for everyone to come in and join us. And um, right, as maybe you can just kind of see, there are probably options here we would want to look at to see if we can add a chat, like so if we do chat. No, oops, sorry, let me share, share your screen. Um, uh, that one at the top, the blue one, yes. Great. So that is a chat. Okay, so people should be chatting right there. Okay. Fantastic, everybody, if you can hear me, just tell me you can hear me great. So William said he can, William said he can, so if William can, y'all can. And great, good, good, Michael. Hi, hi. These are names I'm all familiar with. It's really fun. Um, great. Okay. So maybe what can we do through my account? Why don't we? Um, is there anything else we can do to notify people? Um, yeah, yeah. Definitely let people know that this is working over here, and uh, we can see you now. I can see you in the because <laughs> you're on. If you want your camera to be off, you can turn it off. Right, Hi, Hi, Cheryl. Oh, you're so cute. This is all new for you. So actually, just at the top of the, just like any Google Hangout, where you see the camera, you just X out the camera, and it'll just be your, um, it'll just be your avatar. Do you see what I mean? Just at the top of the, um, no, that's you muted it, which is fine too. Okay, hi everybody. I see people saying something. I checked Twitter for an update. Oh, that's a good idea. That's a great idea. Um, we can do it on Twitter and Facebook as well. Give them the new link. Luckily, I have a friend helping me because otherwise, I would just be crying right now <laughs> like a puddle. Um, hang on. Yes, we're gonna we'll put the update on Google, um, on Facebook, and on Twitter, and um, yeah, we'll do the best we can. I think what happened is I was just coming on early and playing around with things, and I closed the window, and I think I just lost my ability to be an admin. I don't know. It was it wasn't letting me actually host the uh, event. It was only let, letting me view it, and so. We just couldn't figure it out, so we just did it on my friend's account, and here we are. So thanks, everybody, for coming on. Yes, a Twitter post would probably help. I look there, too. Okay, good, 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 good. Good, good, good. And can we do it on Facebook as well? Fantastic. Good. Yay. Well, it's a beautiful day here in sunny California, and um, I'm excited to show you guys some things. And... We, I think, if you're okay waiting a few more minutes, we'll just give a few more people to come on. We have like 120 RSVPs, which is pretty fabulous. Pretty fabulous. Hi, everybody coming on. Thank you. 
Thank you, thank you for your patience. And audio sounds good without me actually screaming. Like, does it sound good with me just talking normally? It'd be helpful for me to know that. We have a nice mic here, and I just want to make sure I don't have to um, strain to talk. So, good. Thanks, William. Fantastic. Yay. This is helpful to see, too, because I imagine all of you see the people at the bottom, and if you do, that cuts off the bottom of the screen, so you don't actually see my pot anymore, do you? This is actually helpful to see, because everybody's um, little, little face is there. Yeah, thank you, William. You're so helpful. I appreciate it. Um, that's fine. That's true. Can't see the pot. Okay, that's helpful to know. So yeah, we'll just you know account for that, and um, you know I can look things up and got the blender. I'll just make sure all the time when I'm doing this that you can see it. So um, yeah, I mean these Google Hangouts, these on-air Hangouts are amazing because of this, because they can reach anybody, everyone, anywhere, um, and they will automatically transfer over to a YouTube video. So it's really fabulous. I mean this works if I can get this working, and I might do a couple more tests before I know, then we can do these kinds of things all the time. I mean, the potential is just so massive, and that's why people are using these Google on Air Hangouts. It's just, I know also anyone who's ever done these has had these difficulties because there's a bit of a, you know, kind of black art to it that, that everyone's trying to figure out and getting help from other people. And so I don't know what went wrong. I wish I did, but at least we're here. So, okay. All right, so just wait. Well, let's wait just a couple more minutes. Is anybody saying anything over there? Maybe we can look. Uh, see if anybody's asking any questions. Or... I just wish I could send something else out. Y'all hold on for just one second, OK? I'm going to be right back. Just wait one second. I think what I can do, at least for one second, right? What I need to do is send out a message. Two That's one of the problems right there. <laughs> he wasn't he wasn't logged in. Just wanna uh, <laughs> um Yeah, okay. It, what it did is just like I Um as if I'm not working. Oh, the mysteries of technology. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Well, you're all here, and we're just going to have to get started, and we're just going to have to hope that everyone will join us, and we've done everything we can to let them know about the new um, event. So thank you for coming to our premiere <laughs> Google on Air Hangout, um, where I'm going to be sharing some fabulous things with you. So if you don't already know me, my name is Colleen Patrick Bro, and my website is joyfulvegan.com, and I have been dedicating my life uh, to empowering people to make informed food choices and to debunk myths about veganism and to be a voice for animals and to give people the tools and resources they need to live compassionately and healthfully. I've been doing this work for, I don't know, 25 years as an advocate and 16 specifically doing this work um, and uh, and it's pretty it's pretty amazing. So you can go to joyfulvegan.com, and I'm going to be talking about some things related to that. This is, was inspired by the 30 Day Vegan Challenge. You know, we're doing a special uh, 30 Day Vegan Challenge online, where um, we're just doing a lot of extra things. People can join the 30 Day Vegan Challenge online program anytime. Any time of the day, any day of the week, any week of the year. But for April, we are doing some extra things where I'm over there doing live Q and A's with everybody. I am. We had a giveaway for the Blend Tech, which I'm going to talk about in a bit. Um, just a lot of really fun engagement. And one of the things that came out of this was doing these live videos and these live cooking demonstrations. So we're going to be doing a lot more of these things. If you're not on the mailing list, you want to get on the mailing list. Just go to joyfulvegan.com and do that. 
and uh, et cetera, et cetera. So what I decided to prepare today, I'm actually going to move the pot, so you don't even need to see the pot. I'm going to move over my, my blender, is we're going to do a pasta alfredo sauce. And this is from the 30 Day Vegan Challenge um, book, and which is right here. I was so much more prepared when this was planning on working well. But this is the new book, The 30 Day Vegan Challenge. And this is the pasta alfredo with walnut parmesan here. And it's just really fabulous. You know, alfredo sauce is traditionally, conventionally used um, a lot of butter and cream to make it. But as I always say, that it's not about dairy-based butter. It's not about dairy-based cream. It's about fat and salt and texture and mouthfeel and familiarity. So something like a pasta alfredo sauce, you do not need the dairy-based butter. You don't need the dairy-based cream for sure. And in this case, we're not even using uh, anything. Of, well, we're using cashews to create all of the fat and the creaminess. And I know a lot of you are probably familiar with this already, using cashews to create creams and to create cheeses. And so... Um, so we are using that, and I soaked these cashews. These are raw cashews, and they are um, unsalted cashews and unroasted, completely raw. And I soaked these overnight. You can soak them for an hour. You don't even have to soak them overnight. Let's see if there's any questions coming up here. Um, yeah, we'll just have to do another. Are we really going to do another demo next weekend? Really, is that is that so? Um, so these are soaked. If you don't soak the cashews, they're just it's not going to come out as creamy. But I've done it without soaking them. You know, whatever. I like giving options, but really you want to soak them for at least an hour. And right is it's actually really helpful if you can see if there's any questions from people because I have to squint and look and <laughs> it's annoying if I have to do that. So if there's any questions, I think there's a way for people to like raise their hands as well if they have questions, which is fun. So um, I'm here for you. I'm checking questions if they come up. Hi, everybody. Thanks for joining us over here. So sorry for the technical difficulties. Thanks for coming over and being flexible. So you cannot see this because of the... This is good to account for. So this is the Blendtec blender, okay? So you're all familiar with what a blender looks like. This is the Blendtec. And I'll be honest, it's amazing. It's amazing. Now, I had a Vitamix for many years, and people who have their Vitamix love their Vitamix. That's great. If it works for you, then fantastic. I didn't have a high-end Vitamix, so I actually was very frustrated using it because, you know, you have to kind of still push things down and stop and really start them if there's not enough liquid. It was just still just problematic. It was still just not fun. And whatever. There better versions than what I had, but when I had the opportunity to test out the Blendtec, of course, I took it. And it is so fabulous. And so as part of our April 30 Day Vegan Challenge, um, some lucky participant is going to be winning this same Blendtec blender. And I'm so excited for them because it's fantastic. Now, I do have a link on my website at joyfulvegan.com. There's a little graphic on the, in the sidebar and there's one down below if you're on the home page. And if you go through that link, if you're going to buy a Blendtec and you can through my site, it's a little affiliate program I have with them. Any Blendtec blender they carry can be bought through their website. They also have refurbished. So you can also get refurbished ones, which are you know, a lot more affordable, a lot less expensive. So they're like $300 or something. So if you're going to buy it anyway, buy it through my website and, um, and experience the joy that is Blendtec. Any questions? Any questions? There's a Q&A app. I know. You know what? Because, Michael, this is my friend's computer, and this is the first time he's using Google um, uh, uh, Hangouts, he doesn't have the app loaded for the, um, for the Google um, for the, for the Q&A. So I know that there is an app, and we had it all set up when I was on my computer because we had to switch. We didn't have time to, to do that. So we will have to do that again next time. Live and learn. Live and learn. You good? Yeah? What's that? The video call is full. Okay. Well, you're going to be an exclusive group of people. Because apparently the video call is full. I don't know how that works. Why it didn't go out as an on air? It's just saying it. My friend's trying to speak sign language to me. It's okay. <laughs> um, well, this is an exclusive call. Oh, I guess what happened. Oh. No, sorry, hang on. No, what you need to do is a different link we need to share. We sh that's why. You guys aren't supposed to be here. Love you all. 
but you're not supposed to be here. I wondered. This is what I was wondering. You got the link to join as a participant, and you can stay because I love you. But um, what we need to do is go to where it says links and share the event. Remember what I was showing you before? Can you guys hold on for one minute? I'm so sorry because this way, this is going to be full. But see, I think people can still watch, but no, they don't have the link to the event. So hang on, you guys. I thank you for your patience. Hang on. This is this one. We sent the wrong link. So since you're, where? No. This is what we need to do. Okay. Hold on, everybody. This is the problem. Let me go to my friend's account. Okay, hold on. Are people saying that they can't get on? No. All right, well, we'll just try this. Here's the Redux. That's what this one's called. Go to Redux. And then, see over here, come here, because you're going to need to learn this. See where it says links right here? That's the link we need to send them. What we did was we sent, so what am I going to do? I'm going to mail this, mail this to me, and we'll do the same thing. So email that link to me. Okay, so send that to me and then yeah. Great. Okay, thanks everybody. Hold on, let me just go do that. That's the problem. Oh, That should be it. You will. Thank you. Okay. Now, you guys, wait. Um, so, okay. So, if you guys want to get off so that you're not being seen there, I mean, it actually has been helpful because you guys have been texting me here, chatting me here, rather. Um, but if you got off, then that lower part would actually be viewable for everybody. But I want to make sure you get on first. So we just shared the link. Yeah, so what I did with you is I shared with you the link to, to join as a participant, not just to view the event. So is it obvious to them where to go to get, get to that link? Um, folks, if you... If you go to um, the Redux, if you go to the Redux event under Events or Hangouts under Google Plus, you should see this event. There's no, there's nothing other than, you know, there's no graphic or anything, but it says Redux Vegan Cooking Demo with Colleen Patrick Goudreau. And under Links, you should see the event. I mean, if you join that, if you actually join that, an RSVP, yes, I'm going to watch, then you'll be able to just watch as viewers and not as a participant here. So, yeah, so I see some people dropping off. So if you do that, and actually other people are dropping off. Yeah, that's what's happening. That's what's happening. But, you know, I still think other people can watch even though, no, it didn't let you watch. Okay, okay. So what we need to do is everybody needs to, okay, so you guys need to go watch. You guys go to, need to go and accept that you're going to watch it. The thing is you probably didn't get a link for it because um, I couldn't send it out through my account. Um, but if you go to events and hangouts, the thing is other people who got this link are now going to just go here and just join and it's going to keep getting full. What do you think I should do, guys? Do you think I should just try one more time a completely different event and not and, and send out a different link? I mean, what do you think I should do? Because otherwise, this is all, yeah, yeah. Kimberly said she's there, but there's no video. It says it will begin soon. Because we have to start. Oh. We, yeah. Um, I'm so sorry. This was so much work. And of course, I would do it for just 
five of you or nine of you, but it's it was a lot of work, and we had 120 people RSVP'd, which I've now lost, I'm sure, because it's 2.37. <laughs> um, okay, Michael's voting for a new event. Um, Lissy is... Learned, she's just saying, yeah, just, like, learn from it. Yeah, so what's happening is that when people are dropping off, other people are coming on. Okay, I'm going to just... Um, I'm gonna just try one more time, and if you wanna if you wanna just wait for me, then wait for me, and um and I'm just gonna try it one more time. So um, I'll be back. Thank you.